love island is back baby welcome guys to my channel my name is ngozi and welcome to discover ngozi so i'm going to be reviewing the first episode of love island let's just get straight into it guys i've got my stuff on my phone if you see me looking i'm looking at it on my other phone to see what i wrote down okay, i'm going to start with first impressions so first of all we saw Paige. um i thought she was quite sweet and then we had india she gave me like confident vibes she gave me player vibes man eater vibes but i'm here for all of it and then we saw Tasha. I really like Tasha. She seems sweet. And from the get-go, tell that she is quite genuine. So I quite like that. Um, and then, this is funny. Because after... um Oh, no, not yet. And then we have, obviously, um Amber. I thought Amber was confident. She gives me, like, a girl's girl type of vibe. I just feel like she just seems confident. She seems like a girl's girl. And then we had um Gemma. And guys, you know the funny thing? This is funny because it's going to lead into what I'm going to say later. When I saw Gemma... What I wrote down was, I don't know if you can see, but I wrote down, can't read her. That's why I said. And goodness, my discernment is through the roof. Because when I saw her in her intro, when she came on, before she even ever said anything, I was like, mm, I can't really read her, but we'll get into that later. And then we have the boys. We have Dami. I was here for the Nigerian slash Irish accent. I was like, yes, Nigeria to the world. I think he's good looking. He seems confident. I like his piercings. I like a guy who has piercings. I like a guy who wears jewelry. All a bit of me we had liam he seems excited gives me playboy vibes then we had ikenna i thought ikenna was so cute ikenna is a bit of me he is a bit of me he seems really mature um and then i wrote never mind because then he went to say that he likes bundeslinger whatever he say bundesliga i was like oh here we go but yeah i took that mature bit out um andrew i thought andrew was cute as well okay so then we had luca Ooh yeah um so first of all i think india and Paige. i just feel like they probably will be um good friends just because a lot of the times when the first two girls are coming to the villa usually end up being quite good friends i think in um, general this year i have a good feeling about this year guys the cast is very they're very energetic so far all the girls i think they're so charismatic everyone has a different type of personality it's been a while since we had a love island casting where everyone was bringing energy there's not one person of the girls who i think is boring so far like everyone is giving vibes whereas last year from the get-go you could already tell some people were going to be boring um and also when it comes to the coupling i actually quite like that the public got to vote this time just because it just gets a bit long just watching everybody choose just a bit uh. so it's nice that the public got to choose so now they can freely go and mingle because obviously they weren't the ones in control of picking who they're going to be with so i quite like that the public has to choose so the first couple that the public chose is amber and dami i think amber and dami look good together see how that goes but visually they were quite pleasing liam and Gemma, i personally thought they suited each other at first doesn't really seem like she's happy with it though and then india at first guys you know when ikenna was standing and it's so funny because india had just talked about how she cares about shoes and then they zoomed into ikenna's crocs that was so funny because her face she literally looked freaked out by his crocs it was funny I think they look cute visually. I'm not sure if they're going to last. I don't think they will. India seems like... Uh, I don't know. I feel like India could eat that boy alive. I don't know how to explain it. I don't think they're going to last. Just from the get-go. I don't think India and Ikenna are suited. Um, I also thought that Andrew was more suited with Paige. But yeah, we'll see. Obviously, we saw them like all talking and stuff. I think from the get-go, um, India, she seems like... I feel like you could just tell when someone's going to have a long run-in. Because when you come with such personality, such vibes on the reality TV, that's what people want to see. And so for India, like, she's just giving, like, confident vibes. And I love how she said, told Ikenna that she doesn't tell people her type. And guys, like, ladies, you need to stop telling these guys your types. Because men are actually evil. Do you know what they will do? A lot of guys, they will mirror exactly what you say your type is from A to Z. They will mirror it, mirror it three months down the line and boom they'll show who they really are i always say this don't tell people who your type is let them find out unless you want to talk about your type visually but if you want to say oh i want a guy that's caring god fair yeah trust me he's going to become god fearing and caring from the get from nowhere so stop telling people your type and i like that she said that so far i like dami's vibe i don't know how i feel about him and amber working i feel like uh, i don't know i just feel like 
I, I, I don't know i feel like they're both not even feeling it yeah i feel like they're both not feeling it but we'll see how it goes um so obviously already after they get to know each other we see that there's a new boy i was surprised to see a new boy but i'm here for it he's italian his accent beautiful honestly everything about that man is just like i'm not even usually attracted to white guys but that guy was sculpted by zeus like he just yeah he's giving and also what i noticed as well me and my friend were texting during love island and i was like why is Gemma being so mean like what's going on like why is she i just hope it's just the first day and i don't want to judge too quickly but she really was definitely giving mean girl vibes and i was like it's not giving what she thinks is giving like i just hope she doesn't carry on like this but yeah so obviously now um Dev devida devida or davida the italian guy he gets to choose who he takes on a date in the next 24 hours um a lot of the girls are feeling davida basically every girl is feeling davida i don't blame them he's good looking but this episode was promising it was good who do you guys think davida is gonna pick i have a feeling that he might pick um either Gemma or tasha i just feel like he's gonna pick between them and Gemma has made it clear that she obviously really wants him but what do you guys think? What do you guys think about the couples that the public made? What do you guys think about the people individually? Who do you guys like? Do you guys agree with what I've said? Do you guys disagree with what I've said? Just let me know, guys. Um, I'm looking forward to reviewing Love Island. I'm going to try and review as many episodes as I can. Not promising anything, but I'm going to try my best. And yeah, it's looking promising. It's looking good. I feel like we've got a really strong cast. But I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next review thanks for watching make sure you subscribe and make sure you like if you enjoyed this video bye guys